Hey everyone, Tim Schofield here from QBKing77.com. If you ever watch a YouTube video, whether it be one of mine, someone else's, and while watching it, it just took forever to load and buffer, and it got to a point where it was taking forever to load, so you just didn't even want to watch the video anymore. I know I have, and it's very annoying how much YouTube does take to load and buffer videos. Uh, luckily, someone uh, named Mitch and Mitch's blog has actually posted a command prompt you can type in to block certain IP addresses to help improve these YouTube loading times. And now I'm just going to go ahead and do a quick video showing you how you can actually implement this fix and improve your YouTube loading times on your Windows PC. So this should work for Windows 8, Windows 7, Windows XP, whatever version of Windows you are running. You just need to run a quick command prompt on your computer. So go ahead and grab your Windows uh, PC and we can help improve these YouTube loading times. All right, so the first step to this process is just go ahead and click on the link in the description of the video below. Uh, it's going to take you to my website where I have some uh, some command prompts posted. So go ahead and scroll down. This is just a, a test article. I haven't written the full article yet, so it's what this is what it's going to look like. But you will see right here where it says code. What I want you to do first is go ahead and highlight the entire code, right-click on it, and hit copy. So just copy this code that's under here. Also want to make a note to undo the code, you will just need to copy paste this code into your command prompt. So as I said, this should work on Windows 8 and Windows 7. So go ahead and just minimize your browser. And once you've minimized your browser, if you're on Windows 7, go ahead and press the start button in the bottom left hand corner. And uh, it's gonna look a little different. I'm on Windows 8, but this should be your start button. Go ahead and type CMD right there in your search bar and you will see a uh, an application called CMD come up just right click on it and hit run as administrator so go ahead and go ahead and hit yes so hit yes and then you will see a command prompt will open that's for Windows 7 and real quick if you are on Windows 8 go ahead and go to your tiles menu here and just start typing CMD you will see it'll open up a command prompt it'll uh, search for apps it'll find this and just right click on it and then down at the bottom, you will see Run as Administrator right here. So that's an option for it as well if you're on Windows 8. So just hit Run as Administrator. It's going to ask for user account control. And then just go ahead and hit Yes. And it will open up this command prompt. So that would be the first steps to open up your command prompt, whether on Windows 7, XP, or Windows 8. All right, and once you have your command prompt ready, all you have to do is go ahead and right-click at the top of the application. Go ahead and highlight Edit and just hit Paste. What it's going to do is go ahead and paste in that code that we copied from my website. You'll see it's going to add a firewall rule named QBKing77. What that's going to do is go ahead and reject certain IP addresses, which will in turn help these YouTube loading speeds. All you have to do now is just press Enter. What it's going to do is say OK, letting you know that it recognized the command, and that's it. So that's all you have to do to enable this, um, I guess you could call it a hack, um, to improve these YouTube loading speeds. I do want to make a quick note that these IP addresses that we are rejecting uh, will eventually expire actually, so that being said, um, I'm going to try and keep my website updated with the up most updated command prompt with the correct IP addresses, so um, if they do expire that you can come back and then just go ahead and retype in the new command prompt, um, so you will notice if for any reason your YouTube loading speeds are getting worse over time after implementing this fix, you can go to my site and check out the uh, updated IP address to see if they've been updated. But that's it, to undo the code, all you have to do is just go ahead and copy the one that says to undo. I'll clean up this, uh, this page much more. Just uh, copy that how to undo, and then go back to your command prompt, same thing, right click, highlight edit, hit paste, and then just go ahead and hit enter, and it's just gonna delete that one rule. You'll see deleted one rule, and that's it. So if you wanna undo what you did, you can just go ahead and do that. Go ahead and test it out for yourself. I've heard nothing but good things about this, so try it out. Let me know what you think. Be sure to leave a comment, see if it does work for you. Uh, be sure to subscribe to me as well. I'd really appreciate it. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus as well. All links will be in the description of the video below. As always, thanks for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up.